Hello you lovely people, welcome back to my channel. On this extremely cold day, oh my word I am so flipping cold, or should I say night now, because it's actually uh, about half past eight at night now. Um, yeah, I was even cold at work guys, and at work it's always bloody boiling. Oh, but yeah, very very cold day, but it's turned out to be a fantastic day guys for me. Um, thanks to my friends Mark and Vicky. Again, like I said in my last pickups video, guys, Vicky was going into the attic at her mum and dad's and was going to dig out some little gems for me. And I tell you what, I was expecting one or two games, guys. Uh, we talked about what there could possibly be up there, but she has done me an absolute turn, guys. I can't believe what she has donated to my collection. So this is turning out to be not only a mega retro. Uh, pick up guys, but what a fantastic donation as well. This is a fantastic fantastic Oh, I, I just can't get over it. I, I cannot get over What she's done for me here what, what they've done for me here her and, and mark the, the, This is just awesome guys, and I'm so humbled and so honored to add these to my collection You wouldn't believe It's gonna make me dig out something from the back there guys because I absolutely uh, love my Spectrum, guys, but I've been using my Spectrum Vega more. So my original Spectrum's uh, put away. It's all lovely, minty, fresh, boxed uh, in the back here. So I will have to dig it out at some point, I'm sure, to uh, run these, guys, because, yes, they have done me a mega, mega Spectrum. And there is one Amiga game amongst these guys. Oh, my God, the things that they've brought to me. And then there's some three three things here that are very interesting which we'll get to also spectrum but yeah very interesting oh i just can't wait to show you all guys but we'll start at the beginning and we'll start with the amiga game guys because there's only the one but this is fantastic it's fully boxed guys look at that oh my word what a fantastic hopefully you can see that there guys this is fantastic for the amiga Oh my word, is this brilliant. It is, of course, Future Basketball. Oh my word, this is just fantastic. Look at it. I am so chuffed with this, guys. You would not believe. Absolutely chuffed. Two bits. Look at the box. It's just brilliant. Wow, look at it. Of course, it's a hard box, guys, like that. There's the stem there. Oh, it is just awesome. And inside, guys, I, I this is hard to open, by the way. I'm struggling here. <laughs> this is a very hard one to open. But look, it's even got the book, guys. It is complete. Oh, my word. Yeah, even the book in there. And the book is even in lovely condition. Look at that. And look at the back of it. Look. <laughs> Oh, fantastic. I am so overwhelmed already just with this. <sighs> Absolutely fantastic. I can't thank them enough. Oh, my God. To add these to my collection is just awesome. So, yeah, that's the first one, guys, and that's the Amiga game. The only Amiga game there. But what a bloody doozy. Oh, my word. There we go. It's back again, guys, if you want to see it again. There we are. So that's the Amiga one. Uh, then we're going to go on to the very interesting one, guys. Uh, I remember these kicking about back in the day. I'm just checking the date here. Let's see if we've got a date on these, because I'm sure I remember these at school when I was there. I'm absolutely certain of it. I remember seeing them. I might have already been a bit old to be using them, but I remember them being at school. Um, so yeah, let's have a look, see if there's anything there on the back. Oh yes, 1984. I would have been 14 at the time, guys. So I was probably a little bit past this point. But I remember seeing them in school. Oh my God, are these wonderful. Oh, I love collecting 
Oh, the weird and wonderful guys, and this is educational. These three are educational. Now, you may be deceived, guys, with this one here, that they look like they're in video case boxes. Because they do look like video case boxes, don't they? Do you remember these at school, guys? I mean, they also sold them in the shops, and you could take them home, obviously, and then get your kids to practice there as well. Now, this first one is Hansel and Gretel. And as I say, from 1984, guys. Oh, my God, just look at them. There's the back of Hansel and Gretel. Now, inside, guys, everything's there. This is just incredible. Actually, one little book might be missing out of this one. But there you get your book. So you get this bit here. Which uh, basically gives you the story and what have you. Again, these are for the Spectrum, guys. So yeah, there we go. We'll probably take a closer look at these at some point in a separate video. But yeah, there we are. And there you go, guys, the date there. 1984. So you get the, the book there which gives you all the bits and bobs. But you also get a story book, which has the story in it, I do believe. Then you get an overlay for your Spectrum, which is here. It's here, guys. And then, of course, the tray with the cassette. Oh, my God, how wonderful is that? So that's Hansel and Gretel, and they're called the Learning Box, of course. That's what they are, the Learning Box, or just Learning Box. They've all got that picture on the front. Of course, this one's Hansel and Gretel. Does it say there? Software for kids up to eight. I can spell. So, yeah, fantastic to add this to the collection, guys, because I love things like this. To add them to the collection is just awesome, especially when you kind of remember them being around. <coughs> Pardon me. Next is Little Red Riding Hood. So, there you go. You can see there, guys. Again. It says the same thing at the bottom there. Oh, no, this one is I Can Read Words, software for kids up to six. So you can see how they, they differ there. Um, on the back, guys, there we go. There's your stem. Oh, these, they, these are awesome, guys. Absolutely awesome. Do you remember them? Like I do. Do you remember them? See, this is the little book, guys. That's probably missing out of the uh, the other one there. So you get the little book here, which is the story that you follow along. Oh, look, it's, the only, it's got pictures in there, like Mum, Little Red Riding Hood, Mum, Grandma, House, and so on. Yeah, fantastic. Little book. As I say, we're going to take a closer look at them in a separate video one day. There's the back. So, yeah, fantastic. And then also you get the... Uh, the Learning Box Little Red Riding Hood Parent Guide again. There we go. But yeah, with all the same bits as the uh, other one, I presume. Yeah, brilliant. There's the back. And again, the overlay guys is there. The blinking overlays for the Spectrum are there. These are complete, guys. Complete. Oh, my word. Let's put the uh, cassette back in properly. There we go. And there we are. Oh, what a doozy. Absolutely fantastic, guys. Fantastic. Right, I'm just going to put it together a bit. So, yeah. Oh, my word. Am I absolutely stoked to get these guys stoked for it. Fantastic. So, that is, yeah, Little Red Riding Hood there. Then the last one of these. And that is Nine Current Buns. Nine current buns. Yep. There's your stem again. And there's the back again. And let's have a look inside this one. Oh yeah, this one appears to be complete again, guys. So only the one has got the uh, the little storybook missing. Which is a shame, but oh my god, is it fantastic to have it. Wow. Brilliant. You never know, Vicky might come across that book yet, because I tell you what, she's performing bloody magic. Oh, thank you, thank you guys so much. I I'm still overwhelmed. Yep, it's there again, guys. Look at that. Fantastic. And there's your little storybook again. There we are. Nine current buns. 
There's the back of it. What we got in this one then? Oh, there we go. A little bit more of a story in this one. Yeah. Yeah, eight currant buns in the baker's shop and all that. Yeah. Yeah. There we are. Fantastic. As I said, not going to show too much again. Because of that video I want to do on them one day. So let's put that all back together again and we'll move on. So yeah, absolutely fantastic, guys. Stoked is an understatement of the century. Oh my word, to, to find something like this, guys. Oh, this, this is not something you find every day, is it? Come on, you just don't. Um, awesome, awesome. Then, uh, where should we move on to now? Well, we'll move on to this one, guys, here. Not only did she find lots of games, she also found the Spectrum, sorry, the, the ZX Spectrum and how, how to get the most from it by Ian Sinclair book oh tremendous guys absolutely tremendous fantastic what was the price of this at the time granada publishing <laughs> 5.95 that's quite a bit of money back then wasn't it you think that was in the uh the early 80s Ooh, that was quite a bit of money yeah there we go guys you know your usual bits and bobs in there everything you could possibly want to know what a fantastic book wow oh fantastic it gives me goosebumps just holding something like this and what's the year printed on here any year let's have a look maybe inside the cover let's have a look mm -hmm. i'm trying to find it where are we it's got to be in here somewhere isn't it oh yeah 1982 guys 1982 Oh, I was 12. I'm bloody 50 now. Wow. Look at it. Oh, and it gets better, guys. It gets, it gets even better. If that, oh, if you can even top that, you can. It gets even better. So also with it, this fantastic pickups donation. You uh, also had uh, no box or anything with it. I don't know if it, if it even had one, guys. This is the user guide companion cassette for the Sinclair ZX Spectrum. So that's there as well. Oh, my God. And I'm pretty sure that's missing. Oh, my box. I said my box was minty, fresh and like new, but I've got a feeling this was missing out of it. So, oh, fantastic. Fantastic to get this because now it's complete, isn't it? So what I mean, guys, about picking random bits up sometimes, you have to hang on to them, I mean. Oh my God, is this a doozy? Fantastic. There we are. Brilliant. <clears throat> to get that as well. Right. We'll do the games that are fully boxed uh, commercial ones first. So starting with... How do you pronounce this again? Uh, Zenders. Right, okay. The Ruins of Zenders. There we go, guys. Oh, fantastic. Just showing you the back of there, basically, aren't I? So there we are, guys. There's your label. Oh, this is awesome. Yeah, absolutely awesome. The Ruin of Zenders. That's the first one. Then we have a Formula One Simulator. This is a Mastertronics one, this one. Uh, yeah, brilliant. Absolutely awesome. This one comes in a yeah funky yellow case. There we are. Then we have uh oh yes, this one is Eddie Kid Jump Challenge. So Eddie Kid Jump Challenge, that shows the age of that one, Eddie Kid. Wicked. And that is the back there guys. There we are. This is one of those ricochet ones. Yeah. Has that got a price on it? No, it hasn't got a price on it. It's got a couple of these got the prices on the original stickers. It's fantastic. That was Eddie Kid Jump Challenge. Then we have... Is it Starquake, I do believe, is it? Let's have a look. Or Star Quest or something. Starquake. Yeah. This is Starquake, guys. Fabulous. Again, a ricochet one. Oh, Star Quake. Brilliant. There's your label. Just a plain black one there. 
Yeah, fantastic. Uh, next up we have, uh, this is, ooh, let's have a look inside. Oh, Stonker, guys. <laughs> stonkers. Oh, Stonkers, is it? Let's have a look. Stonkers. There we go. Stonkers. Sometimes a bit hard to read what's on there, isn't it? You have to look inside. So, Stonkers. Wow. And let's have a look at the label. There we go. Brilliant. I love all the uh, the stuff you get inside of these manuals here. Look at all that writing there. I mean, that would take about been 10 minutes just to read that, wouldn't it? So, yeah, fantastic there. And on the side, it only says that, of course. Yeah, brilliant. Then we have, oh, this. I, I tell you what, this is a doozy. I love this bloody game to bits. I've got it in many formats, but I didn't have it on the Spectrum, guys, and I've wanted it on the Spectrum for a long time. Um, yeah, oh, and this has got a price on it, guys, of 2 99 Fantastic. This is Paperboy. Game of the year, look. Game of the year. Paperboy, wow. Oh, how fantastic is that? He's going oh, straight on proper display somewhere. I'm going to find somewhere for him to go. He's, that's a beautiful game. Love it, Paperboy. Love it. And again, let's have a look. Look at that one. Look at the label on that. Fantastic. Oh, oh. Thank you guys. I'm just going to keep saying it. Thank you guys so, so much for this donation. And next, oh, they all fall over on me. Uh, next we have the quest for the golden egg cup. <laughs> Look at that one. Wow. And the back of that one. Yeah, it's going to be a very long video if I keep talking about everything the way I am. There's your label again, there, fantastic, in the bottom, Quest for the Golden Egg Cup. I remember this one vaguely, vaguely remember this one. I think it's a bit of a, it's got a bit of a tongue-in-cheek thing, hasn't it, this one, I think. But yeah, fantastic. Then we are next with, uh, by Bug Bite Software, wow. This one is just pool, I do believe, yeah, just pool. Pool, there we go. There we go. And there's the label. Oh, and this one's got a bit of advertising inside for other games. Let's have a look. Let's have a look a minute. Yeah, just that page there. There we go. So that's fantastic to see as well. Brilliant. Right, put him back nicely together because they're so well looked after, guys. These, these are in fantastic condition. They really are. Then we have sticks, guys. Another one by uh, Bug Bite Software. Sticks. I remember this one very, very well. Very, very well indeed. There's a little back bit there. Let's open it up. Have a look again. Yeah, it's got the same old adverts in there. There we are. As you can see there. Yep, same adverts in there. So I won't pull that one out. Then, oh, Pedro, I remember this one very, very well. Pedro, look at that image, guys. Fantastic image, look at it. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh, nothing much to see there, guys. But there we are. <laughs> Pedro. Oh, what's happened to here? Let's have a look. Has this just got a little bit pushed around? I think it is complete. It's just been, uh, yeah. It is complete, the uh, the cover guys. That bit that was missing there was just missing because it was tucked up. Right, let's put him back in properly, let's have a look. Yeah, there we go guys, there it is. Now you can see it, there we are. Fantastic, Pedro, wicked. Loving that, brilliant. Then we have uh, oh, this is another one of them. Let's have a look. Uh, Zoom, guys. Zoom. Yeah. Had to open it up to read it properly, but Zoom. Yeah. And just that on the side again. And there we are. Zoom. 
Next we have Nigel Mansell's Grand Prix. <laughs> Grand Prix, guys. Nigel Mansell's Grand Prix. There we are. Wow. Oh, look at it. Oh, awesome. Absolutely awesome. I remember this one very, very well again. Uh, let's have a look. Hey, there we are. Fantastic. Oh, I'm so stoked, guys. Really, really am. Brilliant. Next we have... Oh, a zip zap. Zip zap. Another title I vaguely remember. There we are. Hey, zip zap. Yes, vaguely remember that one, guys. Vaguely. Then we have one with a price on the front, guys. This is one here. Uh, and it says... What was that again? Uh, Long Eaton Software Centre, one ninety nine. That is Steve Davis's sn uh, snooker, guys. Yeah, Steve Davis's snooker, fantastic. One ninety nine. Wow, look at that. Very young Steve Davis, there, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, and this one is there. That way around. There we go. Brilliant. Again, fantastic to add that to the collection. To add any of these to the collection is fantastic. Then we have Treasure Island. Ooh, Treasure Island. Here we go. Treasure Island. Not much to see there, but I'll show you anyway. Let's open that one up. And there we go, guys. Wicked. Don't remember this one at all. It doesn't even ring a bell. I expect it's pretty bloody good. Well, hopefully it is. There we are. This is one I remember kicking around all the time uh, back in the day, guys. And it's uh, yeah, Sinclair ZX Spectrum Chess. This is made by Spectrum themselves. That's why, isn't it? Oh, yeah. By Sinclair. Yeah, there we are. Brilliant. Superb. Right, so that's all then, guys. Now we're on to the ones that are, uh, yeah, shall we say, pirated. <laughs> so the first one is, uh, it's got Quest and Jewels of Babylon. So Quest one side, Jewels of Babylon the other side. So not much to see there, but yeah, Quest and Jewels of Babylon. Hmm. That's good. Then we have one here that is actually a commercially released one, um, but it's missing the cover and the uh, the tags have come off. But they're in the box, guys. So yeah, this is they stole a million. So you can see it's just a blank disc, blank disc. <laughs> it's just a blank tape. Yeah, but they are in here, guys. There we go. There's one, and there's number two. There. So they are in there, so that's fantastic. They just need to be reattached. You can see where the glue got old and they came off. So fantastic that. Put that back in. This comes in a plain old case like that. There, there we are. Just like that. Oh, sound like Tommy Cooper. Ooh, just like that. I tell you what, that's about fitting for the time, isn't it, Tommy Cooper? Uh, this one is Gauntlet, guys. Gauntlet, fantastic. Is there anything else on the other side? No, it just appears to be Gauntlet. Can't make anything else out there. It says BM on the other side, so I'm not sure what that is. BM. But Gauntlet, that's already fantastic, isn't it? Gauntlet. Oh, I love that franchise so much. And this one, oh, again, guys, what a fantastic franchise. This one has Manic Miner on it, guys. Manic Miner. And I'm not sure what that says for the other one. It says uh, Arcadia. Arcadia. Hmm, that could well be what's on the other side. But Manic Miner is on one side. Because it says so there. Manic Miner. What does it say on the other side? Let's have a look. Nothing. It's just blank. So yeah. Could be Manic Miner one side and Arcadia the other. But yeah. Manic Miner. Brilliant. And the very last one here. Is oh this one's just the blank one I do believe is it? Oh no it says something inside here so it's just blank on the cassette. 
There we are. Just blank there. But it says here, flag for like one side, I presume, and ball on the other. So I'm not too sure where this one goes. Bit of a mystery one, that one. I'm going to have to discover that more, aren't I? But yeah, again, fantastic to have whatever it is that's on there. Bit of a mystery uh, cassette, that one. Oh my word, what a fantastic, oh my god, my head's going to explode uh, with excitement there guys. Oh, it's very, very rare these days that I get hold of a, a fantastic little Spectrum lot, guys, but that is a fantastic Spectrum lot. Mark and Vicky, thank you, thank you so much. Um, not only did you guys do me an absolute turn with Harry... Uh, Donating two games to my collection. You have outdone... Oh my... Well, I can't even say how much you've outdone yourselves. And I'm so humbled that you thought of me and passed them my way, guys. And you know what's even more astonishing? It didn't cost me a penny. I mean, with me and uh, Mark and Bicky, it works a bit here and there. You know, we help each other out a lot with tech things, shall we say. And uh, no doubt... When they want something, I will be there for them. If they need something, I will be there for them. So, oh my God, guys, I can't believe that you did this for me. And as I said, guys, it didn't cost me a penny. They donated this lot to me. Just like Harry donated his two fantastic Mario games to me the other day. Um, yeah, I, I can't thank those guys enough. I hope you enjoyed this pickups video. It was a bit of a different one, wasn't it? That's for sure. Didn't even have to go to a shop. They were, uh, yeah, I got in from work today. My, uh, yeah, I had a message saying uh, from Vicky saying that uh, there's a, some treats there for you when you get home. And I was like, ooh, that must be those couple of games. And then I walked in and I was like, I saw this Christmas bag standing there. Full, full to the brim. This, this bag, full to the brim, guys. This bag, full to the brim. And I was like, oh, my word. Oh, fantastic. So I hope you enjoyed looking at these games, guys, and other bits there, wasn't there, like the book and uh, the very interesting educational ones. They're not exactly games, are they, but they're educational thing, and they're very, very, very uh, rare to get hold of, I'm sure, because I haven't, I haven't seen them since leaving school. I've never seen them around since. Um, so yes, guys, hope you enjoyed that video. Again, Mark and Vicky, thank you so much. And again, Harry... Hello, Harry. Thank you very much for your donation. In my last pickups. Oh, awesome. That's all I can say, guys. Now, I'm going to say the usuals. If you're not subscribed already, please think about dropping me a sub. Give me a thumbs up. Tap that bell icon so that you actually get notifications. Because lots of people have told me now they are not getting the notifications. So, just make sure you tap that bell icon and the all icon that comes up. And you'll have a fighting chance. Of winning, of winning, oh my god, I'm losing the plot. Winning, I think I'm the winner. I won today, that's for sure. It's like I won the flipping prize of the year. Oh, that's all I can say. With that, I'm going to say I'll be in. Cheers and goodbye, guys, as I take my crazy self away. Bye bye, guys. See you next time. Bye bye.